Recently setting up some of my courses on Udemy, I found it necessary to have a both a switch and a router on my as a virtual appliance. And ideally I wanted to go to Juniper and Cisco, but their price point is extremely high and the logistics of getting that just seemed very cumbersome. So I did some research and I found some free and open source versions of routers. Although they don't have the things that Cisco has, such as EIGRP when it comes to routing, they do have such as RIP, OSPF, BGP, and those things help too. So I'd like to present you with the, well, 10 of the ones that I've found actually, the open source routers that you can download for free, play with, and maybe use in your virtual environment. Number 10 is Zero Shell. And Zero Shell is pretty nice because look, at, it almost looks like a Linksys router on steroids. It has VPN, it has load balancing features, it does firewall and routing, and that's what makes it awesome. You can download it, it's free. The website is zeroshell.org. The next one is Bird. And like the other ones, it offers BGP, RIP, OSPF, and I, of course IP version 6 and IP version 4. Which IP version 6 is going to be a big thing maybe a couple years from now or next year or sometime like that. Or it might be even a big thing now. really depends on who you ask. But their website is bird.network.cz. All of these are going to be in the show notes, by the way. Along with a little description of what they are. Number 8 is Quagga. Quagga Routing Suite. I've heard of Quagga from PacketPushers.net, their podcast. And I wasn't sure what is it, so the good thing is I found out about it. Their website is Quagga, Q-U-A-G-G-A dot -G -G net. What do we got to? Number seven? Yeah, number seven is called XORP. It almost looks like it's Xerox, but it's not. It's a XORP. They're their own deal. They're a open source routing protocol, as of course all of them are, right? Um, the only thing is, is the last code looks like it's been updated on the 12th, or rather the 11th of January, 2012. I don't think routing has changed much since then, so that's probably okay. Number six, FRR routing, or FR routing. FRrouting.org. You can do BGP, ISIS, OSPF, and RIP. Looks like it's a fork of Quagga, so that's a good thing. Cool thing about these, this website, if you click on download, you'll see the user guide. They have, you can participate in creating some of it. They have a Slack channel, which is nice. Number five is OpenSense or OpenSense.org. It's a firewall. It's a router. It's everything. I also like their slogan down here. It says, can your firewall do this? What I also like about just this website in general is you click on developers, then roadmap and future. And they give you a list of things they're doing, like uh, projects they've completed and things they've planned. And they just say, okay, it's not completed yet. That's just really nice, open transparency or transparent with their customers. That's a really nice thing. Number four, pfsense.org. You can also, you can download it for free, right? But you can also buy one if you so desire, a virtual appliance or a actual box. You can, you can buy it, which is nice. But we're not buying it. We're just downloading the free version. I'm fairly certain, though, their products are a lot, have a lot of value, and they're considerably less than the other guys. The Cisco's, the Junipers of the world. Number three, Vios. V-Y-O-S dot I-O. This one I actually use in my development environment. It's very easy to set up. There's a lot of nice tutorials on the internet that I can I can use and learn about. It's easy too as well. It's not all complicated. Number two is open mesh, open-mesh.org. I also like the fact that they're real about some of their other software such as Mesh Linux, basically telling you this software is out old and uh, hasn't been developed for a while. You might want to use something else like OpenWRT. And finally, number one, 
Open BGPD. So it's really just from the Open BSD project. The website is openbgpd.org. So this is just a few of the open, the free routing protocols out there. Of course, my favorite of, among this list has to be BIOS, just because I've used it a lot more than the other ones. I'd like to thank everybody for viewing this video. Please subscribe if you so desire and like the video. Thank you and have a great day.